I'm just confirming, just confirming the booking you should have the booking, okay? Uh, so like I said, there's 17. It's the Viking Venus, 17, plus the driver and myself, makes 19. And it's the three-course lunch. And we'll be there at 12.35, okay? <coughs> Brilliant, thank you, Sean. Cheers, mate. Bye-bye. doesn't appear to have heard of anything. Cheers now, bye bye bye. question here there are a lot obviously there are lots of farms you're going to be passing here in a rural area you'll see lots of cows and sheep and uh, some people say that Northern Ireland is one great big farm once you come outside of Belfast and of course that applies to most of Ireland 
And also some people say there are more sheep in Ireland than there are people. Again, you're getting a lovely view here of the beautiful County Down Dublins. <coughs> so, the little hidden gem that we are going to uh, show you today, that you will never have known exists, all right? We're going to come through a little village called Killy Lay. So that's K-I-L-L-Y-L-E-A-G-H. And at the back of Killy Lay, you're going to see Killy Lay Castle. And you get your first view of it here on the right-hand side. There are parts of this building that date back to the 1100s. And this looks like it's a castle out of Grimm's fairy tales. Yes. It's right at the back of this little village of Killy Lay, and at the other side of the village is Strangford Loch. And I always think this, look at that, you can see it now. Yes. I always think this looks as if it should be right in the middle of Europe. It should be somewhere like Moldova or Liechtenstein or something. But yes. here it is, right in the center of County Down less than 20 miles from Belfast and we wanted to specifically bring you this way so you can actually drive up to it. It's act, it 